and Jabili coming to you live from Orange County Brewers in Lake Mary. I gotta say, first of all, to the few of you in attendance and uh, hopefully millions watching around the world, <laughs> never in 20 years of being in the event business have I had to adjust an event to be socially distanced outdoors, requiring everyone to wear a mask. But the beauty of it all is, as crazy as things are out there, the beauty of everyone being here and everybody watching is what we truly, really appreciate because that's one thing that has stuck around for the last 20 years. And it's something I believe that's gonna stick around for eternity. Surrounding ourselves with wonder, wonderful people throughout the community, raising money for a children's cancer foundation, which you've been doing for the last 10 years. I'm happy to say that since we started raising money for Base Camp Children's Cancer Foundation, we've approached the six figure mark. This year alone, with the help of the 22 committee members and each and every one of you that have donated through sponsorships, through ticket sales, and just coming to these events when you are able to, without even hosting Black and White Weekend, which is our annual charity event, we raised over $9,500. And unfortunately, so many people are shutting down because they have no choice but to do so, and others are having to adjust their personal lives for this pandemic that's happening. All I can say is thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for watching. And um, like I said, I wanted to host this event. We're supposed to have over 250 people indoors and out. That couldn't happen tonight. But what we can do is adjust, and we've adjusted by following all the rules that Seminole County has in place. Wearing masks, having san hand sanitizer, you know? At the end of the day, the numbers keep fluctuating out there. So what is right and what is wrong? One thing I truly to believe to be right is keeping your health up to par. Because without your health, nothing else matters. Without your health, you can't be with your family, you can't support to survive your family, and you can't live to see another day. So at the end of the day, no matter how crazy things are out there, please come to us for support. Come to us if you need help promoting your business. And most of all, come to us if you need help uh, expanding your health, right? Building up your immune system. We've got so many connections out there to help you do just that, okay? Now, I didn't prepare this speech because, again, I'm going off the cuff with everything, okay? So we're here for, for uh, three reasons. Number one, I didn't want to push back the event anymore. I came out to the location. I'm hosting it because I was just tired of pushing it back, right? But at the same time, I'm doing everything that I'm supposed to be doing, keeping everybody safe by you being able to watch it at home. And the few of you that are here today, I thank you so much. We've invited, most, for the most part, all of our Black and White Weekend sponsors, all our uh, charity members, uh, and all of our ticket holders. As we know, all the major events are being postponed until next year. Black and White Weekend went from May 16 to October 10, 2020. I'm not even sure that's gonna happen. So we have another backup date of May 15, 2021. But one thing I know for sure and I am so grateful for and Basecamp is so grateful for is that every single one of you has not asked for a refund. What you've told me is, Heisem, keep that money with Basecamp and keep this event alive. Because at the end of the day, once we get through this pandemic, I'm going to bring back together, and I've got goosebumps thinking about it, I'm going to bring back what I started 10 years ago. A thousand of the most incredible, healthiest, amazing people in the world at Black and White Weekend supporting Basecamp. Thank you guys so much. And with that said, we're also here with IBA Success Magazine to do the live cover reveal of the newest edition. And with that said, I'm gonna uh, join me, uh, our committee member, and the owner of IBA Success Magazine, Jennifer Yon, to take over. Thank you. Woo! so much Hysom for letting us um, jump in your event with you and come to everyone live of course we're here again thanks everyone for that's tuning in and watching um, like Hysom said we hope it's thousands that's watching this video right now share it tag your friends um, this is the beginning of a new campaign with IBA Success Magazine. We are out here. We are being safe. We have our masks. I have mine. We have our hand sanitizer. So um, a little bit about IBA Success Magazine. When I created the brand, it was really about to do what I'm passionate about, which is 
promote, empower, and educate globally. This is our global edition. This is just pure delight to bring it to you today. In order to get this next person on the cover, we ran a very amazing cover contest, which was the first of many that we will do every year. Like I said, it's the global edition, and our cover person just so happened to be um, a CEO of an organization that helps individuals globally. So I hope that you all will subscribe, if you have not already subscribed, to IBASuccessMagazine.com. Check it out, read her story, um, but we're not gonna hold you all any longer. We're gonna invite our cover person up with me. Um, come on, Melina. Yeah. She's very amazing, amazing floral, just I might add, because this is the floral edition um, with Orlando Network at the same time. So she has not seen the cover yet. So she is gonna be able to see the cover alongside you all and everyone that is watching. Okay, and then um, you know I'm going to pass the mic to you because you have to talk just a row for a minute, okay? Um, so, no, I want you to go back on that side just for a second. We are going to flip over. First, I got to say, you know, I was on the cover and I'm still on the cover, so it's a, I'm happy to pass the crown over to you. <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put the mic down for a second and I want everybody that's here in attendance to count with me as we flip over the mic, as we pick over the curtain. Okay, you all, we're going to count to, to the count of three. <laughs> there we go. One, One two, two, three. three. <laughs> Welcome to the global edition of IBS Success Magazine. We are pivoting through pandemics, Global Voice with Melina, and introducing Shop Success. I invite you all to subscribe, read her story, and I'm just going to give you the mic for a few moments, okay? Thank you so much. I want to thank everybody for watching and I want to thank you, Jennifer and Kate, for the opportunity. This is so amazing. I can't believe it. Um, you guys definitely have to read the story, but I'm going to tell you guys a little bit about my company and my business. Uh, we are a translation interpretation company and we work with many patients. We work nationwide. We're here to help people. That's what I love to do. I'm a people person. Everybody that knows me knows that. I love to help others. And that's why I think my business is so successful because we do it from the heart. We don't do it, we do it, you know, to help. We don't really do it for the money, but we do it to help others. So I'm so thankful for this opportunity. Thank you so much for being in the cover. I want everybody to know about our company that, you know, if you guys need any help with translations, call me. <laughs> Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you all for tuning in. And um, again, don't forget, like Jennifer Yan Agency on Facebook, Instagram, as well as IBA Success, and read her story, which will be live tomorrow morning. Thank you all again for coming out and for watching. Have a good night.